Today we are going to see how we will install dBeaver, one of the GA2 tool for relation database. So if I am searching like dBeaver, dBeaver download, dBeaver Mac. Okay, so download dBeaver commentation. So there is a commentation with the limited functionality and uh, enterprise edition with uh, more fun functionality addition functionality so we, we don't need anything uh, enterprise edition right now so we are going with the basic one community edition. so in my case I have mysql and uh, postgres SQL installed on my system, but right now I am only going with MySQL. So we will install dbviewer first, then after uh, completing this one, we are going we are going with uh, MySQL database. So we can see how we can do the things using dbviewer. It's almost same like a DB visualizer, so uh, but yeah, but it is a uh, different. So whenever you are clicking, it will open. Okay, so it will open like this. So here you can select what you need. So MySQL 8 plus MariaDB, Postgres, Apache, Hive. So I select MySQL. Then we need to select the port and the root password. So any password is fine here. So it will test connection details also. to detect test connection. So it's saying like basically uh, this voice can download drivers. So I need to download drivers. Access denied. There is a password that I need to provide, but we don't know. I don't know actually the password. So I am touching public key details. Public key retrieval is not allowed. So that's actually the problem so I'm just going to finish right now so I can see all the details here download SQLite sample database so if you are here you can see so this include a problem with my password I guess so public key retrieval not allowed so I am searching for that what is the solution Zeni user solutions okay okay there's going to be more problems okay so there is one Okay, so we need it's related to the security setting. So if you are looking here, it will, it will go here. So I need to edit connection. So there only we need to provide all the details. So here use SHS, SSL, we need to make it false. That's the one. That's the problem they are showing here. So Beaver. Yeah, this is a common problem with the dbeaver. So there will be some solution for this one, but I am not sure about that right now. Okay. Anyway, we can work with uh, our SQLite here. 
you can see all the tables available and uh, the properties here uh, no properties data here properties here here diagram will be here how it's related with the uh, different tables and uh, uh, yeah the people uh, the table without any relation also there and whenever you need to make a query or something you can SQL editor you can do that so here I am selecting like select all for album and I have an option to right click execute so it will uh, execute that and return the query so uh, everything is possible and it's very useful tool and uh, you can also connect the remote databases so if you have something in the docker environment that also you can connect probably we can check whether it's possible uh, in my case i have some docker instances docker ps minus a can see some of them here whether I have any database is one so I have Wildfire, Tomcat, Kibana, Elasticsearch, Mongo, Excel. Mongo, we cannot connect Mongo there is also a MySQL that's running on 3306 I guess but I, I'm not sure whether we can start because we, I have already one uh, MySQL instance so probably i cannot do that right now so that's all for today tomorrow we are coming with some other things thank you for watching have a nice day